It is proud to express that it's truly the only plugged-in internet television production company on the market. Amp2.tv live streams all their shows across all the major selling markets in the U.S. and abroad. Call them at 866-224-5422. The AmpSquare.tv library allows productions to be seen over and over again, making commercial platforms more usable. Call 866-224-5422. Toll free 866-224-5422. Amp2.tv, the first and only internet television network that's truly plugged in. 866 224 5422. That's AMP, the number two, dot TV. Now you can get Talk 1470 WNN on 95.3 FM2. FM, oh, Loud and clear, health and wealth radio, WNN. The opinions expressed on the following sponsored program are strictly those of the host, guests, and callers, and not necessarily those of this station, its staff, management, or sponsors. It's the Becky and Boca Show, coming to you live every Thursday night at 6 p.m. from glamorous downtown Boca Raton. I'll show you how to live life in style in one of the country's most elegant cities, nestled right along the beautiful Atlantic beaches between Palm Beach and Miami. So sit back, relax, and let me show you how to indulge yourself Boca style. Hello, welcome to the Becky and Boca Show. Tonight, my show is all about teenagers. It's out of the way so you can see Janet back there. And um, it's going to be about hair, makeup, and clothing for teens. But before uh, we get to that, I want to talk about an event I'm having on June 30th at 445 East Palmetto Park Road. The um, Anti-Aging Center of Boca Raton. It's a three-story building right down by Trotteria Romano. It's going to be 6 to 9 p.m., and I'm going to have so much fun stuff there, and I'm giving away thousands and thousands of dollars worth of free raffle prizes, including Botox, Prada sunglasses, shampoo and blowouts, an Hermes scarf, lots of fun stuff. So look for that on my Facebook page and RSVP. We're going to have food. We're going to have music. We're going to have drinks. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, now I have so many people in the studio tonight. I have like a dozen people here. So I'm going to be switching guests out because we want to show you all this fun stuff for teens because we figured it's summertime. Let's do something about teenagers and uh, let's show some hair, makeup, and fashions. We have um, three different people here. We have Janet from Mistress Hair. We have four different people. Then we have Ivy and Lisa from Ivy Lee's Luxe Makeup and Beauty Lounge. And we have Brittany from Teen Angel that supplied all the clothing that these girls are wearing tonight. So, let's get started with Janet. Hi. Okay, so Janet <laughs> styled all of uh, all of the hair on these girls. I want to move this mic so I don't keep hitting in the face. Oh. Um, Janet styled all of the hair on these girls, and she's going to talk about hairstyles for summertime and what she did uh, for these girls and different kind of styles. So Yeah, well, right start? now it's nice because everything is in the season. So there's nothing you can do that's not going to work. And basically, these five girls have all have different looks that will work for the season. Yeah, that's what I love. You created totally different looks on all of them. Yeah, there's there nothing they are. <laughs> so we have Eileen and Elena. Yeah, um, Eileen. Um, El Elena, I'm sorry, is the first. Mm -hmm. And she has more of like an 80s look. So yeah, 80s is that. coming back in. Like last year it was 90s, now it's 80s. So it's just like you could do like a half up, half down with that kind of like uh, palm tree pony on top and do different different kind of curls, smaller curls. Yeah, you curl that like uh, barrel curls, right? What do you call it? <clears throat> it's kind of, I don't it's, know a my lot. it's a lot. mix. <laughs> so there's barrel curls and there's a little crimping. So it's just more of a fun, flirty look. That's very cute. Yeah. Very cute. And on Eileen, I love Eileen, that. so braids are, have been in for a while, many different braids. So micro braids are pretty popular now, just smaller braids. So if you're wearing your hair down and it's kind of basic and blah, you could just dress it up with just a simple braid and maybe throw some colored yarn through it to make it fun. Um, but we did two braids around her crown of her head and attached yeah, turn, them. Um, turn all the way toward Ale Elena. Oh, yeah. isn't that pretty in the back? Yeah, oh, wow. so it dresses up. And, but it's like a yeah. little boho style, and it dresses yeah. up 
a daytime look. Um, and I noticed a lot this year for proms, a lot of girls mm -hmm. wanted these big, poofy braids. But skinny braids are in style, too, now, so you guys could play around So that's with called that. a skinny braid? That one, no, is a braid, but it's been pulled out and made, like, thicker. So it's more bohemian looking. Yeah, I like that. There's one on the other side, too. Yeah, yeah. so way. it wraps around like a crown yeah, on her head. Yeah, it's so pretty. It's kind of like jewelry on the head. Mm -hmm. That really is pretty. Yeah. And then you do curl the bottom of her hair, too? Or yeah, she's got some beachy there. waves. Very, very nice. Very nice. Um, okay, you want to... Can we shift back to Janet here? Because Janet has a hair a hair thing on herself that we want to talk about, too, yes. for a minute here. So what's in style Wait, now we gotta get, is... We've got to get the camera back over here. <laughs> but you can go ahead and start talking about it. Okay. <laughs> um, sleek high ponies are in. So a lot of people are go. doing sleek yeah. high ponies. So that's what okay, I so have in. Okay, so it's turn. I'm going to get this my... This one, maybe? Uh-oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Keep talking. It's a sleek high pony. Oh, okay. There we go. So we're you're going to um, do your hair really sleek back. Uh, Kim Kardashian has done this a lot in the past. Yeah, that is. That does look good. And like now, that. if you don't have the hair to support this long, kind of high pony, if your hair is short, you're going to run out of uh, hair to work with. Um, I sell at the salon at Ivy Lee's these wraparound ponies. So this is not mine. It's not your hair. No. Mine's hidden in there, and it's really short. <laughs> but um, you can't see it. But this whole pony gets attached to your pony and you wrap the hair around the top so you don't really see that it's it's not synthetic it's actually really human, it's human hair. hair it's human hair it could be curled and colored but it gives you that longer effect yeah and that's great for summertime too when yeah and it's great for when you don't feel like washing your hair like it's like a quick yeah, yeah. Yeah. Quick way to get your hair done. Okay, while the cameras over here are going to switch you girls out and let's take you two. <laughs> okay. Get in there. We have so many looks to show you. This is very fun. Oh, okay. Oh, look at those. Right, we'll, we'll get back to him. <laughs> okay. Okay. So we have Taylor and Anna. So if you want to start with Anna over there. Anna the has a um, sleek straight look, which is coming in now again. So it's kind of like a runway look. And it's inspired by like old time kind of share. So yeah. it's just really, I love that. there's no volume. It's just really shiny and sleek and clean. That's really cool. Yeah, and it yeah. looks nice with like a heavier eye and then a very pale part, lip. Yeah, just parted down the middle. Yeah, and she very just pretty. got her hair cut, so it looks really <laughs> yeah, clean nice and neat on the yeah. bottom. <laughs> and it's easy for these young girls to just yeah. like, what do you flat iron? Flat iron. Yeah, simple. Yeah. yeah. I love that look. And Taylor. I Taylor. love that too. Taylor actually basically did this herself, and I just tweaked it a little bit. So it's really easy. Um, it's good if you're in a rush. Um, we like to call it like the undone bun. So you kind of just, if you have enough hair to support it, that's really you just nice. wrap it around on top and make it look undone. But there is a little effort put in. Now, if you don't have a lot of hair, can you do that with the ponytail? Uh, you can do, do that with the ponytail, and basically you're just gonna wait. We gotta sl switch back to Janet here for a second. <laughs> you're just going to take the hair, and if you don't have enough hair, you're going to tease it. <coughs> <coughs> Maybe. Oh. <laughs> All right, so you okay. can do it. You just twist it around and wrap it, and then if it's not big enough, you could tease it and poof it up to make it look like yeah. there's more volume. That looks really It's nice. not cute when you have like a t teeny little donut on top of your head, so. <laughs> yeah, it's got to be big. Yeah. So, okay, so these are two nice summery looks for teens, and uh, I'm amazed because, you know, we, I brought all these girls in there, and you did all these cool things. Quick, too. Okay, um, now let's switch you two out for a minute. And we might Thank be... Thank you. <laughs> we're going to bring in one person now. <laughs> okay. And this is a re returning guest on the Becky and Boca show. This is Lexi. She's Miss Teen Boca Raton USA. Did I say that right? You got it. Okay, <laughs> and Janet, what did you do with her? Um, Lexi, the, uh, another style that's in is half up, half down. And this has been in for a, for a while. It's just like a top knot, but using just half the hair. So Taylor's, all of her hair is wrapped around the top. Mm -hmm. And with Lexi, you just take the crown of your hair and wrap it around and then throw some soft waves through the bottom. Okay. And that's another easy style, especially if you don't feel like washing and making your hair really sleek or with a lot of volume. You could just poof it up on top and give it a little style. That looks really nice. Thank you. I like that a lot. And Lexi normally wears a crown, but we decided <laughs> that <laughs> for, the hair. for tonight she wouldn't. Yeah, she could do a lot with her hair. I mean, it's just so yeah. much length and volume. 
Okay, what other tips can you give us for, for summertime? Because, you know, everybody's over at the beach, and like me, you know, I usually get my hair blown out, but I'm planning on going to the beach tomorrow, so it's going to be all yeah, a mess. But I want to so fix it myself, but not, I n it never looks as good when I do it. You can always do a pony. That always works for the yeah. beach. A sleek pony. But what about um, after the beach? Because I go in the water and everything. Oh, so, so when it's kind of straggly and yeah. you want to, like, make it look pretty decent. I think like if Lexi blow. was going to go swimming. Okay, she'd come out and... So it she's going to be a little bit straggly. Um, so I think the best thing to do is just a really low braid. It's low maintenance. Right. And it keeps all the hairs together so you don't have all these flyaways when it starts drying out by the sun. So low braids are easy and it's a quick, simple look for the for the beach. Yeah. Yeah. You could always do like a quick top knot like Taylor's also. Quick top. That's cute. Yeah. All right, sit back down here, Taylor. I want to compare the two buns here. Because it's the same look, it's just that you left some hair down with Lexi. Yeah. So Lexi's is, you know, all down, but the crown is up and Taylor's is all up. But um, I would recommend pulling it back to some degree if you're doing outdoor beachy, especially in humidity. Because mm -hmm. yeah, that's, that's not... another thing. Yeah. Any, anything good for... Do, do your girls do your hair for when it's I mean, humid? It does. So I kind of just throw it up in a ponytail usually. Mm -hmm. But... Like in summer, I don't spend time like straightening my hair, curling my hair, doing nothing. I just throw it up. Yeah. There's no point. See? Okay, because it just gets too frizzy. It gets too frizzy. But you can you always can make it look good in the messy bun or with like a headband too. So mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. headbands, of course, those big hats are in style. So those are really easy just to throw on and no one knows what's going on underneath. Exactly. But yeah. <laughs> yeah. And carry a little serum around because if it is getting frizzy mm -hmm. and or your bun or braid looks really frizzy, a little serum will help. Okay. Okay, so, um, all right, any other summertime tips for, oh, they can't hear. Okay. <laughs> any other summertime uh, tips for hair? Um, I would us? say sunblocking your hair, especially if you're coloring it. Um, like Sunblock? A UV, like a UV protectant for really? your hair. Yeah. Oh, wait, you, buy, you buy it special for hair? Yeah, you buy it for your hair, and it's like a spray-in, leave-in kind of conditioner mm -hmm. with UV protectant. Um, a lot of the girls have this balayage and a lot of bleach, mm -hmm. and it gets really brassy from the sun. It'll turn maybe a little orangey. So if you put UV protectant, um, which is like a leave-in, or wear a hat, I would recommend that. Because it'll, it'll kind of ruin your color. It what about oxidizes. salt water? Does that ruin? Salt water, chlorine, and sun will really oxidize oh, your color. I'm going to your little friend here while... Yeah, he um he likes to sunbathe. <laughs> Wait, can I hold him? Yeah. We brought a little buddy in. <laughs> What's his name? Mr. Tress. Mr. Tress. Jack. <laughs> Jack. <laughs> Janet is uh, Miss Tress Hair. That's her brand. And this is Mr. Tress. Yeah. And Isn't then at cute? the salon, we specialize in everything hair. So whether it's keratin treatments, uh, hair extensions, blowouts, color, um, between me and the other girls, we kind of yeah, cover every gamut. There. Yeah. So what, now what's the latest in keratin treatments? There's some new ones that don't um, even damage your hair, right? Really, they're not, they're not meant to damage your hair at all. It depends. Everyone, it's customizable to everyone's hair. So if you have thinner or damaged hair, you're not going to heat iron it as much. Okay. Um, but there are different types of keratin treatments, but they all basically do the same thing. Um, there's Botox for hair, which is What's another that? version of a keratin treatment. How does that work? Um, it works the same way, but it's used with glycolic acid. So it's just another chemical, and it'll help tame the frizz and keep your hair silky, especially through the humidity in summer. So if you get a keratin treatment, how long does that last? Um, it varies on different people depending on how much you wash, but it usually is around three months. Really? Yeah. It lasts that long? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. And you can go out in any kind of weather and it's going to stay straight? It will won't stay pinned straight. It just takes a lot of the frizz out. Oh, okay. So my mom's due. She's coming in this week because she's really frizzing out and my family is yelling at her. So she needs a keratin <laughs> treatment. <laughs> yeah. So when your frizzy. family starts yelling at you because your hair's too frizzy, then you got to go back and see Yeah, that. yes. Okay. And tame it down, what? especially in the summertime. Okay, now let's talk about other summertime stuff. Um, now, my hair doesn't frizz up. No, when it gets you're lucky. Yeah, I don't know about that because what it looks it looks like I got a bucket of water dumped over my head when it's humid out. You know, no, it's it smooth and silky, so you don't have to do any of those keratin treatments. No, I don't. But still, in the summertime, it's like you know, if I get a nice blowout and I walk outside, all of a sudden it'll get a little so, stringy. Yeah, it's just totally like you know. A mess. Well, a little dry I shampoo will help. Oh, that's a good idea. That's easy. You just part your hair, spray it in, and shake it around a little bit, and it'll take the oils and that stickiness away. That's like kind of like getting bunching together 
and it smooths it out. Do you have any particular brands you sell them at the? I yeah. like sexy, the uh, big sexy products a lot. Big sexy. They yeah. do, they make the dry shampoo and they, they make, make um like a powder that <laughs> you shake in <laughs> and a spray. I used it on some of the girls for volume today. <laughs> Give me a kiss. Yeah. Okay, so, oh, you did use it on some of the girls. Yeah, it, okay. it will raise your root a lot if you put it in the root and shake it, and you'll get a lot of volume for an up to. Oh, nice. But it also takes some oils out. So if you're not going to wash your hair and you feel like it's looking a little unwashed, you just spray it in and shake it around. Okay. So okay. it's a quick tip. All right. Um, you girls know about it, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Maybe pan back to these girls again with the bun. So you used... Um, you used it on their hair, the dry shampoo? Yeah, dry shampoo. They had, The girls with the buns are pinned in a little bit. Okay. And then um, a lot of uh, moisturizing oils at the ends, especially with the sleek hair. Okay. So you have to keep it like tamed down and really shiny. You can't do that look and let it kind of frizz and get messy. You don't see Kim K's hair all messy, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay, so if someone wants to get a hold of you, like if they want to get one of these... Um, um, so it's a wraparound yeah. Do you want to get the price on that? Um, these are 165 okay. human hair. They're 20 inches. Uh -huh. uh, so you could put this wraparound pony over your hair to make it long. And I also have the halo hair slips. Oh, that's right. You have the beautiful yeah. hair slips. And those are human yeah. hair, and they just add a lot of length and volume. And it's put underneath the crown of your natural yeah. hair. I have and one of those. Those yeah. are great. You go from short to long without any damage, and it takes a couple of minutes. Right, Jack? <laughs> Where are you going, Jack? No, no, no. no. <laughs> I'm going back to Janet. Okay. Okay, so you're at the Beauty Lounge. You're at yeah. Ivy Lee's Lux Makeup and Beauty Lounge, which is at 233 South Federal Highway in the um, same building as Mateo's. Yes. That's how people Oka find it. Grand building. But you also have a website, which is? MistressExtensions.com if you'd like to just look at the extensions. And if you want some information on hair, color, cuts, and pricing, that would be www.mistresshair.com. Okay. And um, how do you match the ponytails? People would have to come in and... They come in because I have a lot of samples there, and it's best for me to see them. Mm -hmm. And then we match them and, and get them done. Um, as far as the halos, they're always usually stocked. So oh, yeah, the halos. You have all yeah. different colors in there. Yeah. That. If you need it and you're going out, you just pop in and I had Janet done. on a show before, and she brought the halos in, but I want to describe them. They have a... It's a clear piece of uh, wire that goes right mm -hmm. across the top, right? Yeah. And then down here is the hair. Yeah. So anybody can add it to their own hair, and Janet cuts it in so it looks, it looks yeah, like it's part of your hair. Yeah, you just, like, cut it into the haircut. You don't want it to be too, too long and dragging, so you want it to look natural, just giving yourself a little length and volume. Yeah. And even if you don't want length, you can just do it for volume, right? Because I've seen people just that wear them that you cut it the exact length of their yeah, hair? Yeah, I have one my length, just to uh -huh. make it look thicker and healthier. Yeah. And then a longer one for, you know, late nights. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you girls don't listen to that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they have the long hair naturally. But um, a lot of people wear um, extensions, too. You do that also. Yeah. Like you do tape-ins and... Tape-ins, um, which is double-sided tape. Uh -huh. The fusion, which are uh, individual strands that are kind of melted in with keratin. Okay. Um, and the halos, those are basically the three most popular ones. Okay. And people yeah. can come to you and... Uh, yeah. Your oh. phone number? Yes. You okay. can call me. My local number is 954-465-6005. Okay. Yeah. And get a free consultation for anything. All right. All right. Thank you, Janet. And thank, thank you, guys, for Molly and Heather. The girls are going to stick around because... Uh, Next, we're going to talk about their makeup, and we're going to go to break here. So, um, Janet and uh, bye. Jack. <laughs> yeah, bye. Bye, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> He's a thank cutie. you, Becky. Okay, thank you. Tighten skin on your face, neck, and body, and lose fat at Ageless Body Sculpting Plus, located at 445 East Palmetto Park Road in Boca Raton, where you'll find scientific technologies, including the latest acoustic lipolyzer, which uses ultrasound for immediate and permanent results. No surgery, diet, or exercise. If you don't lose inches, you don't pay. Call 561 654 0177 for your free consultation. Serendipity Consignment Boutique is unlike any other consignment shop you have ever seen. Lisa has the most beautiful and immaculate designer bags, clothes, shoes, and accessories. It's a designer candy store. So go check out Serendipity Consignment Boutique 
Glades Plaza, 2200 Glades Road, Boca Raton, or visit their website at consignmentboca.com. You've been listening to and watching The Becky and Boca Show. Ivy Lee's Lux Makeup and Beauty Lounge in downtown Boca Raton does fabulous professional makeup application. Make an appointment today and see how glamorous you can look. Call 561-409-4065 to book your appointment. Ivy Lee's Lux Makeup and Beauty Lounge is located at 233 South Federal Highway on the first floor of the Boca Grand Building in Boca Raton. The number again is 561-409-4065. And now, back to the show. To talk about their makeup. Yeah. Hello, welcome back to the Becky and Boca show. Okay, I've switched out uh, some of my guests. I have uh, Ivy and Lisa now here. We'll have Lisa next to me and have Ivy across the table. We'll get to her in a minute. They're the owners of Ivy Lee's Lux Makeup and Beauty Lounge. And I took all these teenage girls in there today so that they could do some teen makeup. Because uh, it's summertime and there's lots of, um, lots of people out of school. And we thought it would be nice to feature teenagers. And Ivy and Lisa are going to tell us what they can do as far as makeup for teens. Well, yeah, this is Teen Trends, and we just had a really big month in May for proms and graduations, mm -hmm. and, you know, we were dealing a lot with all the different looks, so we just created some different looks today, um, like... We okay, have we have Miss, uh, Miss Teen Booker yeah, down here Miss in USA, Booker. and, uh, okay, tell us what you did with her. Um, for her, we just kept it simple. We did a glitter eye, um, let me see... So, I just wanted and bronzy it. and glitter, and because glitter is fun, you yeah, know, it's yeah. fun, and this is a really like fine ground glitter, copper tone nude lip, and it's not too overpowering. Um, some of the other girls we did right. a dark lip, mm -hmm. a smoky eye. Yeah, see, eye. this is a real, real light pale lipstick. I like mm -hmm. that. Yeah, I'm and it's nice eyes. and fresh. It's not too much, even though you know. The girls now want do want more of a heavy look, but you yeah. can accomplish so much with just a little also. So mm -hmm. and it's appropriate. It's not doesn't make the parents uncomfortable, but it's right. still fun. <laughs> mm -hmm. What do you think, Lisa? Yes, but it's also I've noticed with prom girls, they really want that glam. It's mm -hmm. it's unbelievable this yeah. day and age. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So I guess if they're going out to a formal thing, then you can really yes. lay on the yeah. really lay on the glam. We have to talk to the parents. Yes. <laughs> get the yeah. okay. Can we put the fake eyelashes uh -huh. on or not? Did you put eyelashes on, Lexi? No. 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 Okay. I I kept it clean and simple. You yeah. know, just like really focused on, like for her, Same. I did the glitter. So that's all you want. And these girls can do this on a regular basis mm -hmm. at home on the weekends if they're going out with their girlfriends to the movies. It's more about that. It's yeah. less about us doing a big glam look on them and mm -hmm. more about just trends that they can do at home. Yeah. So, you know, with a little bronzer and mm -hmm. some gloss and just glitter, mascara. Yeah, that really yeah. looks nice. Yeah. So you put some bronzer on the cheeks. I see that there. <clears throat> yeah. Highlighter. Bronzer on the yeah. Cheek, highlighter. But like summer. I said, it's just fun for them to be able to do at home because what we do professionally, a lot mm -hmm. of times they can't recreate. You know? Right. So this is more about doing, giving them something that they could create themselves. You know. Right. Um, simple teen. I mean, I'm not a teen by any means, but I was... <laughs> You're closer than me. <laughs> this, is, this is like how I like to personally wear my makeup, like a like a statement lip or just a, a fun eye and keep it youthful and, yeah. and glowy. So it's just easy. Mm -hmm. um, okay, let's trade you out, Lexi, and bring in Elena. Sure. Okay. Now, this is a dark lip. I like this. Yeah, this is a yeah, statement she lip. Great. She has, um, for her, um, we just the did this, like, a statement lip. So, I really yeah. didn't even do mm -mm. any eyeshadow. I, I took a little bit of the highlighter and took it on her eyelid, but we contoured and did that nice vampy lip and her eyebrow, a lot of mascara. And that's it. And it looks, mm -hmm. it looks really pretty. And I like the lipstick because mm -hmm. it's it's matte, but it doesn't it's look a dry. Matte, yeah, and it's like a nice 
not too dark, like, because you see some of those, like, black tone, like, fun, mm -hmm. funky colors. But this is, like, a nice, pretty jewel tone. Yeah. And um, the highlighter, I think, just, like, really pulls it together. Is that the same highlighter you used on Lexi? Um, yeah. I have a pigment at the studio that um, Ivy Lee sells, and it's really, we use it for everything as far mm -hmm. as the eye. I think I've used it on you that... It's like the loose powder pigment. Oh yeah, yeah. So you can mm -hmm. put it on your eye, yeah, at least it on my and then I yeah. like can you can. Oh, take you put it, it on the cheeks too. You can take it up yeah, and anywhere. put it on the cheek oh. for that extra punch of like highlight. So now you sell all this stuff at the. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this lip is um, the raisin lip liner, and I just fill the lip in with it, so mm -hmm. it keeps gives it yeah. that matte look, but not drying. So right. it's not like cracky and you know. Mm -hmm. It's not drying at all. I yeah, love that. It's pretty. And it's simple. It's easy. Like right, I said, easy. these are looks that they can do. They can do at home. And it's not too much. It's not like, oh my gosh, she looks like she's 25. And, you know, yeah. but. So a girl can come in and buy everything that they put on your mm -hmm. face and then recreate it at home. Because exactly. it's not, you're not doing real complicated stuff with these exactly. looks. Exactly. That was kind of my yeah. goal for this is to keep it like user friendly, but teen and fresh. And mm -hmm. I take that into my adult clients as well. You know, yeah. I think it's uh -huh. really like, I think. This show is about teen trends, but I don't see a different. I use it right. on everyone. On everybody. Yeah. On everybody. So. Um, okay. Now, do you have anything coming up for teens, or you can do parties and things like that? You were telling me. Yes, we um, we do birthday parties at the studio, or um, just kind of like a fun girls' day if you want to. You can get a bunch of your friends. We can Wouldn't that be fun? put together cater. a package. We cater food. Photography, and, if you want. Yeah, photography. Yeah. We were talking about selfies. They come selfies, in and they get all yeah. wound up, and then they get beautiful selfies of themselves. Yeah, and what was we had a really cute tea party-themed birthday, and... That was like that was really cute. Like five, six, seven girlfriends mm -hmm. came and they had like a tea party set up in the studio and they all got a makeover and they, they all got their pictures taken. Yeah, and they all got their pictures taken and yeah. then they opened their presents and yeah. did their own thing and we have a really pretty lounge area. So yeah, it, it's gorgeous. really makes for yeah. like great photos mm -hmm. and just a good environment. So that's fun. So if someone wants to do any kind of a little birthday party or yeah. any kind of a celebration with girlfriends, or they can Absolutely. call you up yeah. and you can customize yeah. exactly Taylor, what they want. Yeah, yeah. Did. Taylor, we Had did a birthday party. Party. Let's swap out for Taylor and Taylor can tell yeah. us about it. Yeah, you can talk about your birthday we party. We did all their makeup. I love that. It's so cute. I like that. Okay. A little modeling? Okay. <laughs> All right, so Taylor, do you did a birthday yes, party? Yes, did your birthday party. <laughs> yeah. In the beauty lounge, sure. So That's what it was like. All, my, a little closer. Friend, all my friends and I, we all got our makeup done. Well, I didn't because I was running around like a maniac. Okay. But um, we all got our makeup done. We all took pictures, and then um, we went to go eat at Mateo's. Oh, which is right in the building. Yeah. How fun is that? And then my cake was like, had like little makeup things on it. It was a matte cake. It was a matte makeup cake. cake. Yeah. I have a picture really of it. Cute. It was really pretty. But it didn't taste bar, that good. Candy, candy bar. bar that's right. Oh, yeah, we had a ca oh, candy, candy bar. Oh, candy bar. We, had, mm -hmm. we put a little studio. red... I made them get a little red carpet for yeah. the yeah. walkway. Red. And the that's little... Really cute idea. Um, the, the, movie, the movie side thing, yeah. thing when they go, like... The, so the we can do, like, anything there. Themes, yeah. What a great idea. Yeah, it's really cute. And it's really... Girls just have so much fun. We just have so yeah. much fun. And any ages. age. Yeah. Right. Yes. yeah. That's like the thing. Makeup it's party. like from 12 to 75. Like, mm -hmm. you have these, like, fun little parties in there. And you can customize it any way they want. Hair, yeah. makeup, yeah. nails. You could do all of yep. it. Yep. Mm -hmm. Or just... Yeah. or just We do yeah. everything. Excellent. All right. Tell us about Taylor's makeup. So, Taylor, I did a smoky Taylor, eye. Taylor, look at the camera. Taylor. Taylor, look at the camera. Right here. <laughs> so, it's just two oh, colors. That's not my hair. It's just two colors um, on her, like a smoky eye, no lash, to keep it kind of red carpet like. Because so you didn't do any lashes on her either. Mm -mm. Okay. Um, and it's like a a really pretty gunmetal color, which I personally love. Gunmetal smoky. It's mm -hmm. not too much. It's makes a statement, but yeah. it's not. It's still kind of soft. If you look at her, it doesn't. Right. Look, mm -hmm. No, she doesn't mm -hmm. look like she's got too much. It's makeup not on. harsh. Yeah. And then a, a so the moms contour. will love that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Like it. it shows you don't like, want them to look like they're too made up 
-hmm. I love her lip. What is going on there? That's the a matte. Which one is? Which one did we use? Bridezilla. No, Bridezilla is not that I always wear. That's the dark one. Oh, yeah. Okay. We have a we have a few shades of uh, mm -hmm. matte nude. I told her to pick one out and um, touch her. I love out. that. And yeah. I personally like matte because like I like to touch everything. So it doesn't <laughs> get all gooey. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it does. You know, you almost might think she doesn't have lipstick on, except right. that her lips look better than they would look exactly. without something else. <laughs> and it, like it goes with the smoky eye. Yeah. So yeah. it's not too much. It's not right. glossy and smoky and all this makeup looking. It's, it's, mm -hmm. it's right. a good look. And then I see she's got some of that highlighter, highlighter on too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah, lots of highlighter. Very, very pretty. Mm -hmm. You like this look, Taylor? Yeah. I know you're pretty good at makeup yourself, yeah. so you could probably duplicate this easily. But do you think it would be hard for girls at home to do it? No. No, because as long as they have the um, the makeup, the makeup, mm -hmm. and the right brushes. Right. Yes. So people can brushes come in. So important. And. Okay, you'll yeah, do the makeup use, and then I they can get... I use one of the Ivy Lee's palettes on her. Mm -hmm. um, it's, a, it's a trio palette. It has a gunmetal. It has like a, a soft gray. So it's nice. You can switch it up and use different things and mix them if you want to make it lighter. And then um, oh. one of our matte lips. Really pretty. Really yeah. pretty. Yeah. Okay, fine. we're going to switch you out for Anna now. Okay. Now this, I love this. This is like a 60s look, though. Well, you know, like that between the hair and the makeup and everything. Thank you. <laughs> 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 yeah, that came with the outfit. Yeah, yeah. so cute. Yeah. It's like a baby. We're going to have Brittany yeah. from Teen so Angel cute. on here next telling us about the clothes. But, um, yeah, really cute, cute, cute purse. Okay, so she almost looks like she doesn't have much makeup on. I can see the eyeliner, but yes. other than that. So for her, which actually looks really cute with the outfit. Yeah. <laughs> I just did a light wing liner, just a. Kind oh of, yeah, I see that. Kind of like a mod, like a mod, teen mod, like simple. But she doesn't wear a lot of makeup, and a lot of teens aren't comfortable mm -hmm. wearing a lot mm -hmm. of makeup. So this is just nice and simple. It's it's cute. It's really pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look at that. So it's like a um, a nude sheen kind of on. Yeah, on the lid? I did. Um, I did the pigment on the lid. That's it. And then I used right? a BB cream. Um, for her foundation, which is like a tinted moisturizer in a in in a way, um, kept a nude lip, like a pinky nude lip, and then just yeah. like that top eyeliner. Really pretty. That lip's pretty too. Mm -hmm. Very Thank natural, you. but uh, yeah, it looks great. Thank you. I love it. Very yeah, nice. it's simple and like I and it's clean. Say, yeah, it's clean and user friendly and yeah, and everyone can do all of these looks. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, Eileen, you're next. Come on in here. All these looks are so different, you know, with the clothes, the makeup, cute. and the hair. That's actually really cute outfit. Yeah, yeah. All, all of these cute. clothes are from Teen Angel. Very, very cute things. So, uh, okay. Tell us about her makeup. She almost looks... You know, there's not, not a lot of eye makeup there. No, this was just all about skin, bronzy glow. Um, yeah. I did a gold on her eye, a lot of mascara. Um, the I love how it goes with the hairstyle. Yeah, you know? very like natural. That. Very natural, yeah. but yet there's makeup. So yeah. it's like a nice peachy cheek and... It's, See, it's moms, not, it's not like yeah, you don't right. have to be scared. Than yeah, right. yeah. You mm -hmm. have, you, their makeup, you don't have to be too much all the time. You know, this is these are all really light looked and really pretty, and just you know, evened out their skin tone and just right. add some color for that freshness and lots of mascara always. So. Lots of mascara. I'm me. I'm me. Use, use the eyelashes, but yeah. yes, <laughs> you're our, our glam. Do you ever queen. put eyelashes on teens? I yeah, guess you can. Oh, yeah. we do. We do. Yeah. Um, some are just not comfortable with a lot of makeup, and mm -hmm. that's natural. Like I know a few of these girls, like ha like you don't mm -hmm. wear makeup, and so this is something you know it's she would be comfortable with just yeah, at home. You know that she can just do at home, but it's still like fun and. Yeah, because I'm looking at her skin, and it's just um, very natural. Glowy. Like, yeah, it Glowy. glows. It looks yeah. like she glows. Yeah. yeah. And it almost looks like no lipstick, but I know you put something on there. 
Yeah, it may have um, faded away a little bit. I haven't <laughs> seen her in like an hour. So. <laughs> right. Yeah. No, no, I, I don't still know, see it. I don't know what you guys are talking about. <laughs> pink and pretty, but um, it's not like a lot. Like. Yeah, I mean, food. with this, you can you can do anything. You can do do like a pink sheer gloss or in champagne nude. Do the matte. Do a statement lip. It's mm-hmm. it's more about that bronzy glow on the cheek and just. Yeah, she almost looks like she stepped out of a painting, yeah. doesn't she? I mean, very, very, very yes, pretty. Yes, exactly. Very pretty. Okay, um, Lisa, let, let's let you talk for about five more minutes before we end here because okay. I want you to tell us about all the things. Okay, let's say I'm a mom, mm-hmm. which I am, but I have two sons. <laughs> so I wouldn't be bringing them in the beauty lounge. But if I had daughters and it's summertime and I'm looking for something for them and their friends to do, what kind of things do you have to offer? Well, we do makeup classes, which oh, yeah. we can have like a teen makeup class, and you can get a group of your friends, and we can show you how cool. to do these looks. You know, we'll have food and, and something, some water or whatever they want, and um, we'll have them bring their makeup just like we do with, with the other adults, classes, yeah. and kind of show them. Sh- teach them the correct way to apply makeup so it looks natural. Yeah, that's what I like about they it. They can Isn't look Very wear hands it, on. yes. Yeah, mm-hmm. in our technique and yep. teaching them. Yeah. So um, I'm thinking, you know, are you talking about lunches? People come we in for lunch? We could do lunches, we could do dinners, we could do any time. You know, um, like I said, we're kind of open to cater to whatever, whatever schedule. I'm thinking like a pizza party. Yeah, yeah. yeah. absolutely. Pizza party. It is yeah. fun to. Gosh, when I was yes, a teen, I would have loved it. Yeah, it's fun this. to like talk to some to the mothers and plan right, these things yeah. because it's yeah. like planning a party essentially. And so. especially with Instagram and all mm. these kids are so into thinking. makeup. Yeah, mm-hmm. and Snapchat and all that. So. You know, we can have a fun party, and they can Snapchat. They'd and be sharing it all over the place. Because the, yeah. look, at, look at the and cool it, party my mom got for me. Right. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it's fun. It's a yeah. real, you know, it is. fun place. Yeah, it's a fun place. We have a boutique um, manicurist there that can yeah. roll her little station around and give you. Mm-hmm. And she's got all sorts of mm-hmm. interesting things, like the sparkly nails. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I love that. Wait, show, hold your hand up here. See, it's like, you can't see that far. Sparkles. Right? No. Sparkles. Yeah, it's spark- we call this the Ivy Lees. So. Yes. <laughs> the Ivy Lees. Yeah, yes. <laughs> Gold Spark- glitter. And nails. Yes. <laughs> okay, so people could do this for birthday parties or mm-hmm. just for a get-together. Yeah. Like, yeah. want to, like, Anything. night out with the girls. Yeah. We had um, two women that actually bought it a gift for their friend. So they came in, they got her, they and surprised her, her they brought her in. Mm-hmm. We did a pl- complete makeover, mm-hmm. and then... They went to lunch, so there's all little yeah, things so that we can do. Yeah, so many options to, you know, we're mm-hmm. here to cater to any ideas. Have and your party mm-hmm. in the late afternoon mm-hmm. and then go we, out to dinner. Absolutely. absolutely. We, lo- yeah. we are located right in the right middle. Right downtown. You can walk yes. to all the yeah. nice restaurants from there. Yeah. Hopefully we get our golf carts. <laughs> yes. You're going to get a golf cart? Okay. Yes. <laughs> I heard it's going to be pink. Yeah. We need <laughs> we, pink sparkly. We said we really, really need, need a golf cart. A pink, pink, pink out there glitter. <laughs> Anybody want to donate it? I have no problem. sparkly uh, <laughs> golf, golf cart. That that we put Ivy Lee's on the side. And we'll drive around <laughs> What are the big it? ones? You want the big one, we, right? Like yeah. a little bus. Is, yeah, it needs to sit, well, mm. like, you know, <laughs> maybe six people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we can, you know, go to restaurants. Because you're really close to every yeah. town. Yeah. Right yeah. the street. Yeah, but yeah. you don't want to walk in heel. No. no. <laughs> you want to go? You want a pink spot? Yes. Yes. It's shuttle people. They come, they get their yes. makeup done, they get dressed yes. there, they put the heels on, yep. and then they get in and your golf cart and you drop them in the Exactly. Absolutely. That we are right across the street from yeah. everything. Yeah. And no, Mateo's is in our building, yep. and you're right. yeah. Louis yeah. Bossy just opened. It's right. crazy busy all the time. So we'll take a golf cart. Yes. Golf cart. Everybody can free makeover. Free makeover. Free makeover. <laughs> free makeover. 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 Yeah. I'd be willing to do that. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> okay, well, give your information real quick here. Your phone number. I know I have your ads running. Uh, I want to come up in a minute, but you're at? We are at 233 South Federal Highway, Suite 104, and that's located in the Boca Grande building. Our phone number is 561 
You can okay. go to Ivy Lee's. Yep. dot com. Ivy Lee's dot com. Right across from Raw Juice. A lot of yep. people, if they haven't been, they're like, "You're so tucked away." Nobody. But yeah. It's hard you're to. You're tucked away, but when you realize where you are, it were yes. right there. Yeah. Everybody goes to Raw mm-hmm. Juice. Mm-hmm. Guy Fried Berry Rapkin, that's a fabulous place. Yes. Mm-hmm. And um, everybody knows Mateo's. Yeah. And you're right there mm-hmm. in the building. That's how I always say, do you know where Mateo's okay. is? We're in the building. We're going to go to break now. We're going to bring Brittany in from Teen Angel to talk about the fashions. Okay? Stay tuned. skin on your face, neck, and body and lose fat at Ageless Body Sculpting Plus, located at 445 East Palmetto Park Road in Boca Raton, where you'll find scientific technologies, including the latest acoustic lipolyzer, which uses ultrasound for immediate and permanent results. No surgery, diet, or exercise. If you don't lose inches, you don't pay. Call 561-654-0177 for your free consultation. Serendipity consignment boutique is unlike any other consignment shop you have ever seen lisa has the most beautiful and immaculate designer bags clothes shoes and accessories it's a designer candy store so go check out serendipity consignment boutique glades plaza 2200 glades road boca raton or visit their website at consignmentboca.com you've been listening to and watching the becky and boca show Ivy Lee's Lux Makeup and Beauty Lounge in downtown Boca Raton does fabulous professional makeup application. Make an appointment today and see how glamorous you can look. Call 561-409-4065 to book your appointment. Ivy Lee's Lux Makeup and Beauty Lounge is located at 233 South Federal Highway on the first floor of the Boca Grand Building in Boca Raton. The number again is 561-409-4065. And now, back to the show. Okay, welcome to the third segment of the Becky and Boca show tonight. We have so many people in here and so many things to get to. I have Brittany with me from Teen Angel. And she's the one that supplied all the clothing for the girls tonight. But before we go to the clothing, tell us about your store. I know you have two of them. Mm -hmm. We have two locations in South Florida. Um, Our our one location is in Delray Boca, um, right on the border on Linton and Military. And it's definitely a destination spot. So it's you wouldn't just walk past it and find it. You Mm -hmm. would know that it was there because it's kind of hiding. It's a it's a nice little gem that is. it's actually not just for teens. People think that it's just for teens, but it's actually for... I want some of these clothes. <laughs> yeah, it's for adults, young adults, teens, and kids. And um, even sometimes the grandmas find good pieces, good tops, and even the mm-hmm. jeans. So we call it generational shopping. And the second location is in Parkland. It's the same merchandise um, in both spots. Okay, and I know you have a lot of things. We have so much amount of mer- mm-hmm. clothing. So Very. we call it like a department store, almost. Yeah. And you have shoes? We do. Bags? Mm-hmm. Jewelry? Yep. Um, anything else? We have... I know you have little bralettes and all that We do have stuff. bralettes and sometimes undergarments to go, like special undergarments for certain things, um, like some of our special occasion wear. Mm-hmm. We also have a special occasion wear um, for all occasions, really. From really, really dressy. Like, if you're going to oh, have... Oh, yes, I saw that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, not so much prom, but but girls do find things for prom. Oh, I saw some things in there that look Yeah, good. for sure. Yeah. And homecoming. Yeah. Um, a lot, a lot of bat mitzvah shopping and sweet 16 shopping. Um, and for those kinds of special occasions. For your own and also going to other parties. That's actually how we started um, Teen Angel 22 years ago. It was... Really, the idea was for special occasion dresses Mm -hmm. for girls to wear for their own bat mitzvahs. Oh, okay. But then you branched out. You have a lot of casual things, too. And then we started growing. You're right. Okay, let's pan over here to um, Lexi and Eileen, and you can tell us uh, about what they're wearing. Okay, so Lexi is wearing an off it's all about the off the shoulder right because i'm wearing off the shoulder eileen's yeah. wearing off the shoulder we got some off the shoulders over there it's all, all right, about off the, the shoulder lexi. <laughs> <laughs> so lexi's wearing this amazing um detailed sleeve 
It's and for summer, it's all about the interesting sleeve, the details on the okay, sleeve. Okay, wait, we gotta get the camera over to Lexi. Yeah, let's look at Lexi's. We gotta switch to really cute top. Okay. And I know you can't okay. see her. <laughs> <laughs> Freddie. <laughs> Freddie. <laughs> Okay, we'll, you can keep talking about it. We'll talk about okay, it. And he'll, 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 oh, there, there it is. Okay. okay. So, and you can't see her jeans, but they're super. Oh, those are so cute. cute. I'm wearing the same ones. Yeah. They're retro. They're from Blank NYC, mm -hmm. and they're a two tone jean. So for this summer, two tone jeans are going to be really trending. Um, and it has a little yeah, maybe flare. Maybe stand up a little. Yeah. Can you just like show us your jeans? Us? See, it has like a little stripe down yeah, the center. So cute. You can't see the shoes, but at the shoes, there's like a little slit where you could see her slide in booties. Yeah. Super cute They're outfit. Just adorable. Yeah. Just adorable. Very, very cute. And then cute. the little crystal necklace gives it a oh, little... Oh, yeah, the necklace, too. Yes, the little That's special... Her. Very pretty. So th th you got everything. People come in there Everything. Get... We style girls from head to toe. They come in, and the moms or the grandmothers will say, she needs clothes. Style her from head to toe. She needs the shoes. She needs the the necklace. And sometimes, if it's for like their birthday party, let's say, like uh, like I feel like a girl turning, let's say, seventeen, because you're mm -hmm. sixteen, Lexi. Mm -hmm. If you would turn seventeen, you might wear this to your yeah, birthday for dinner. Sure. For sure. So oh, we yeah. would dress her head to toe. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Hmm? Gosh, where were you when I was a kid? <laughs> That'd be fantastic. Okay, now I love over here. here. I love this. Is wearing again an off the shoulder. Um, with the detail, little ruffle sleeve. Um, it's it's also got little fringe. Yeah, the little tassels, tassels. Are, give it a little more extra yeah. oomph. Yeah. Um, so uh, ruffles are also trending. Lots and lots of ruffles. But you have to be careful because if you have a petite figure, you don't yeah, want to go too crazy yeah. with the ruffles. Yeah. No, that's perfect. Perfect little ruffle. Perfect. Hold up the handbag that, that they put <laughs> with that. Isn't that adorable? A little dash of color. Can you stand up a little bit? Because, you know, I, I hate the fact that we can't show the whole outfit. Okay, see, she's got these, uh, they look like nice stretchy white jeans with the uh, red bandana Pull belt. Pull your jeans down a little. Yeah. <laughs> so I think she's wearing level 99 white jeans. Oh, level 99. Yes. Yeah. And they're um, a nice. real stretchy straight leg yeah. um, jean. And I love the little dash of red with the oh, black and white. Oh, and I love the bag with that, too. Yeah, it's just a perfect a little outfit if you're going out to brunch or you're going to dinner with your family or you're going to a birthday party. Yeah. And I brought the girls in there this morning, so Brittany totally picked out their outfits. And how easy is that? I mean, you just mm -hmm. go in there and she and she dresses you. So mm -hmm. We have great stylists at Teen Angel. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's super qualified to, to give you the cutest outfit. And, and we really um, are very resourceful and creative with what we have there. Yeah, I noticed that. Okay, let's change out, girls. Let's bring um, Taylor and Anna in. And b before Anna sits down, maybe we can take a look at that skirt. Oh, yeah. oh yes, there let's get the, uh, yeah. the, the tie-up detail. It's got uh, lace up the front. That is so cute. So the lace up... Um, idea has been around for about like two years now, maybe a year and a half. Um, I love the lace up. You could do it. So you cute. see it on t-shirts. You see it up the sides of your sleeves. <laughs> and then Taylor's in a little um, little romper. romper. Very cute with floral. And floral is, I mean, every summer floral comes back. Mm -hmm. And and to me, I think florals are very personal. You know, you have to find the right floral print for you. Um, I think at our store, we are very careful with the prints that we buy because yeah. so many people shy away from prints. Yeah, I, I wouldn't necessarily pick yeah. a floral, yeah. but the way you put it on, on that's gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. And the handbag here, oh, look at that. So it's inspired, yeah. uh, if you notice, by Celine. Uh-huh. And this is like the baby version, the, the mini <laughs> version. I love it. That's adorable. So cute. And with a whole, I love the off the yeah. shoulder with that. Kind of a very 60s yeah. looking. They got the 60s hair and everything. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Quite retro. Yeah. Which I noticed that's for summer retro mm -hmm. is back, you know, with Lexi's jeans and with the off the shoulder. Mm -hmm. I love the retro look. Mm -hmm. And Taylor, now you, you have a lot of these little rompers, right? Mm hmm. Rompers real popular. never go out of style. Yeah. Especially in Florida. Yeah. Every right. girl comes in looking for rompers. Yeah. And you have a lot of them. Mm hmm. Because I feel like it's you throw it on and the whole outfit is done. You don't it's have easy. to worry about matching, mixing, mm -hmm. matching. 
They're making men rompers now. What do you think what? about that? You haven't heard of that? No. No, you, you guys have heard of that, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes. Really? Men are wearing rompers. Wear rompers. Yeah, they are, though. I wonder yes. what kind of guys are wearing rompers. I don't know. I think I it's out there mainstream. Not, not very many. Okay. Not very many. <laughs> yeah. I need to see <laughs> we'll that. See. We'll right? see. Okay, okay. so... Um, Anything else you want to say about these two outfits? But, uh, um, the, the, the jewelry is yes, yours too, right? Jewelry, I was about to say that. Okay. So chokers. I love the choker necklaces. Okay. You can do the oh, I love that. little charms and you could do a little cord and wrap it around a few times. Yeah. And then the the leather cord has kind of evolved into the gold um, chokers. And you can That's stack on. them. Yeah, on Taylor. On Taylor. Those are so delicate and pretty. Mm -hmm. Wow. Is that two necklaces it's or is that two. one? two. So girls come in it, because they know we have a ton of jewelry to play with, mm -hmm. and we have lots of little gold, little chains, and little things with charms. And for me, usually, I'm only wearing one today, but usually I'm stacking like four or five little gold chain. I wouldn't mm -hmm. even try to do that, but that looks great. And it kind of reminds me of the '90s. It's like a little, it's a little tip of the hat to the '90s, right? Yeah. With the little gold, all the gold yeah. um, chokers. But I'm loving the black choker with the black um, off the shoulder top. I mean it. Both of these necklaces just kind of make the outfit. Totally. I think accessories completely yeah. make the outfit. And then with um, Anna's top, um, so this top also comes in cream, and you can really dress that top up. Oh, it comes in cream, too. Yeah. Very the skirt, pretty. too. She's wearing the skirt in cream right now, but the skirt also comes in black. Oh, but so you can wear it either way. <laughs> totally. You can wear it either way. Huh. But the top is so cool because you can dress it down like how right. she has it on with the denim white skirt or you can dress it up if you want to put on yeah. um, a dressier skirt and dressier shoes with a little clutch bag and you can go to a party at night very nice okay why don't we switch you two out for you two <laughs> and then we'll um it's just me I think. yeah but i think it's down with you so oh, okay. so you're not lonely because okay. we got five we got an uneven number here <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we haven't seen yours yet. Okay. Okay. All right. And you got the bag to go with yeah, it too. I have a bag too. That's very cute. And you're right off the shoulder too. I'm, oh, you should do the tuck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Everyone's off the shoulder. Yeah. Um. So Elena's wearing again off the shoulder, um, and the ruffle. So you got both styles both happening of them have here. Ruffles. Yep. Yeah, I like that. And the sundress. Yeah. Is that a dress or a romper? It's a no, dress. It's a dress. Oh, yeah. it's very cute. With the little lace detail on the bottom. And it's navy. Mm -hmm. I love oh, navy. Oh, it's the lace on the bottom. That's very cute. For summer, navy is yeah. great. Right. I heard navy's in this summer. Yep. I love navy. Yeah. So, um, I love wearing sundresses. Since we're in Florida, I get the privilege of wearing sundresses all year long, right? right? It's always summer in Florida. Yeah. Um, so, we always carry stuff like this in our store. And you have the bag to go with yeah. that. Oh, that's yes. a cute bag. Does that, how does it open up? Just like Little class. Oh, so it's a big. Yeah, so it's big. I'd probably it's carry it like that and put all my stuff in there. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be able to fold it. That's cute. Wow. I like that. And then the heart necklace. The necklace, too. This necklace has really been a, a huge piece for us. We have it in silver and gold, and it's been a great gift item. That's really nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, okay, tell us some more things about your store. There's two locations. The one mm -hmm. is in Delray, and it's right... Right near the corner of Linton, Linton and, and Military. Military. Okay. We've been there, I think, for about 20 years. So that's the one, the first store was there. Actually, the first store was in Hollywood. It was on Sterling Road. Oh, really? <laughs> mm hmm I think we opened, I think, maybe up in 1996, if I'm correct. Huh. Okay. And then you put, and now you have one in Parkland also. We do have one in Parkland. Okay. Um, so, like I was saying, we started mostly with special occasion wear mm -hmm. for girls' bat mitzvahs and sweet 16s. Mm -hmm. And we've been custom designing oh. special dresses since oh, we yeah. opened. Okay. Or, or close to since we opened. And we're, we're still doing it now. So, we have trunk shows a couple times a year. And you can make an appointment, come on in, take a look at all the samples, and you can pick your own color swatches oh, you had a material. trunk show going on there today right when, when you guys we were came there in. and those were like the, the more dressy dresses mm -hmm. yeah okay so those are for custom design so you can come in and you can design your your dream dress oh wow for your special occasion that's what do you think of that girls would you like to design your own dress yeah. uh yeah i think that's pretty cool <laughs> yeah <laughs> very cool <laughs> wait so uh, for for designing your own dresses can you pick from like 
um, certain tops to match certain bottoms exactly. then? Okay. Yeah. And then do you have like long dresses and short dresses? So? Anything okay. that you can dream up, we can wow. probably do for you. So a lot of the That's girls amazing. now want to do two pieces. That's yeah. a new style, right? To have the little top, oh, yeah, yeah, and, yeah, the top the and a bottom. skirt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you could do a beautiful beaded top mm -hmm. and you could do a short skirt. You could do a long skirt. You could do a high-low. Whatever okay. your heart desires. Wow. And then if if you're just if if that's not for you designing your own dress we have a ton of dresses on that are on the rack that you can try on and take home that day so are the design your own dresses usually fancier than um sometimes the, yes okay but not all um yeah they can be as dressy as you want them to be they okay. can have as many sequins and rhinestones and as much glitter as you want it to be or you can tone it back and have it very simple mm -hmm. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Oh, we need that awesome. for, for grown ups. Yeah. I guess. <laughs> you can do it. Absolutely. I can do it too. <laughs> you can design I can't think your own. I've many occasions I've gone to that I can't find a dress. You can create your own. Yeah. Okay, I want to thank everybody for coming in. And you want to give your phone number or your website? Or oh, yes. How do, we, how do we reach Teen we Angel? We have a really great Instagram. Right, Instagram is where all of your stuff is. It's at Teen Angel Clothing Boutique, and we're updated every single day. We, do, we receive new merchandise every single day, and it's a great fashion inspiration um, Instagram page. So it gives you ideas on what to put together, what's in style, and what we just got in that day. Um, we're also on Facebook, the same name, Teen Angel Clothing Boutique. Um, we're in Delray. We're in Parkland. You can give us a call, 561-496-3161. Come visit me, and we'll style you. Okay. Well, thank yeah. you, Brittany, for coming in. And before we go, I want to remind everybody that uh, I have a big Becky and Boca event on the 30th of this month at 445 East Palmetto Park Road, 6 to 9 p.m., it is at the uh, Ageless, oh, not the Ageless, it is at the um, Anti-Aging Center of Boca. And it's right down by Trotteria Romano, right on East Palmetto Park Road, three-story building. We are going to have a blast. We're going to have food and drink and lots of fun stuff. So everybody come out, look at my Facebook page for that, Becky and Boca, and uh, we will see you next week. Thank you. been watching and listening to the Becky and Boca show. Tune in every Thursday night at 6 p.m. to discover all the ways to spoil yourself and have a good time in beautiful Boca Raton. See you next week. The opinions expressed on the preceding sponsored program were strictly those of its hosts, guests, and callers, and not necessarily those of the station, its staff, 